Hey everybody, uh, I wanted to share with you an, an amazing opportunity that uh, that God has given me to do a mission trip in He's Athens. He's given the opportunity to me too, not just you. <laughs> in Athens, Greece. Um, yeah, I have a lot of family roots in Greece and there's a big part of my heart that's there and I've only been there once and that was just for vacation. This time I want to go to serve God and to uh, to work with people that uh, are maybe marginalized. Um, my friend Scott here started a ministry called Helping Hands almost 30 years ago, and it serves refugees coming mostly from Africa and the Middle East that are coming uh, to Greece, and then many of them move on to other parts of Europe. But they are um, they are folks that are in need of care, compassion, love, and Helping Hands serves them through meals, connecting them to health care, giving them, you know, fresh clothes and a shower and friendship. And for those that are interested, more about God and Bible studies and films about Christ and many, many wonderful things. So I'm excited to go. Um, Scott, share with us a little bit more of what it's going to be like. Yeah, just real quickly, the thing that excites me about refugee ministry is that people coming from closed countries have an opportunity to hear about Jesus, read the Bible without fear of being put in jail or kicked out of their families. And many of them find Jesus in Athens, and then they keep in touch with their friends and family back in their home mm -hmm. countries, tell them about Jesus. Most of them don't stay in Greece. They move on to three or four other countries before they finally settle down and they take Jesus with them. So the potential for global impact is something that excites me very much about this ministry. And I'm excited about this team because it's people from different churches in Rockwood. And for me and for us, this is such an incredible opportunity to plant seeds of unity. Because mm -hmm. my experience is when these things go well, there's a bond that's formed. There's a unity of relationships that happens that comes back and then extends to other people in the community. And so we're very excited about this and coveting your prayers. Yeah, I can't wait to uh, to get over there, God willing, and share my testimony with people, maybe uh, lead worship or lead a Bible study, even clean toilets. I'm game for it all. But um, we need your help and your support. Please pray for us. Uh, we are hoping to leave toward the end of July, but there's so much in the air right now, and we're really hoping we can do that this summer. And uh, please give uh, to support this ministry financially if you're able to do so. I'll put the information below, but thank you so much. Have a great day.